Now we are speaking with Robert Plant. Robert, I understand you met the great Sonny Boy Williamson. Can you tell us about it? Well, I went to one of the blues festivals that was traveling through Europe, and they were very well organized, and they were very... Um, there was a kind of whole vibe about them as it being some kind of mass, some hallowed experience, all these geezers from Mississippi or Chicago coming to Birmingham, England. I mean, they didn't really want to be there at all, but and especially playing to a bunch of squeaky white kids, you know. But I was taking a leak, I was in the bathroom, and Sonny Boy came in, he's like, he was about eight inches taller than me, and he was wearing a Harlequin suit. Now, Sonny Boy was so big and so sort of uh, daunting a character that one of his tricks was he used to play the harmonica by just sliding it into his mouth without using his hands, so it would stick straight into his mouth from the bass notes nearest the back of his throat, and then he would push with his mouth the harmonica in and out and suck and blow so he could actually play it without touching it. He also, unfortunately, used to play it with his rather large nose. But he's taking a leak, I'm taking a leak, and I'm saying, as a million people have said to me, Mr. Williamson, I want to thank you. You've been such a great infra, you know, influence and inspiration. And can I have your autograph? And he looked down at me with those big eyes and opened that mouth with one tooth in and he said, get lost, son. And I said, thank you. A great moment for me. I learned a lot from that. I was heartbroken. I would never do that to anybody. <laughs>